Excellent. Yes, yes, correct. Okay. Now don't go above the line, go below it. Okay, so now you gotta fill up the rest of the cloud here. That's the way you do it. Great. Yes. Maybe it's too much yellow, add a bit more white. A bit more white. Yep. Okay, yep. Very good. Yeah. Correct. Now we don't we're not gonna fill up all the way bottom, okay? So you see we're gonna fill it up like in the middle halfway only. Okay. So do that. No. Okay, so so what you need to do is until here, okay? So this is the cloud area. Okay, so we don't go all the way to the bottom because we want some clouds to kind of like show at the side. Okay, so yeah, fill up this middle part here. All right, take some more paint. Yep. Yeah, not like that. Smaller strokes, your strokes are too big. Small and gentle strokes, okay, like this, see. See like that. Small small stroke. You don't have to I do yeah, it. Like that, like that. See just poke 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 poke. See how I'm doing it? Poke 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 poke. Okay, like that. This is good. What you have done is quite nice. Okay, I just help you do the bottom a bit. Okay, like that. Now try this one. Okay, same same technique. Okay. Hold it, hold your pen like this and then push in small circles. See how I'm doing it? Small yeah. circle. Ah, like that. Do that. Don't do it very like quickly. You have to do, when you do painting right, you gotta do it like slowly. Yeah, correct. Very good. See, you got different colors coming up. Okay, now we need to have some more. Uh, very good. This is excellent. Yes. Slowly, slow and gentle. Slow and no hurry. Are you in a hurry? No, right? Calm and easy. That's it. That's right. Blend the color together. Below, below. Yes, yes. That's it. Now, do them on the side here. Yes. Small, smaller stroke. Your circle is too big. Smaller, yes. All right, then do this side here. Beautiful, see? Now you've got layers to your clouds, right? It's not just one color, you've got many colors. You want to make nice clouds, right? Yes, correct. You need to have layers of clouds. Kind of like, just like scrub it around, give it a shape. Yes, correct. That's the way you do it. And, and make, you know this, this ink marks at the top? Yeah, just go closer to them and stretch them out. Yeah, like a natural feeling, you know, because you want to feel clouds. Uh, keep scrubbing. Small strokes, yes. That's the way you're doing. Absolutely correct. Yep. Yep. Very good. Excellent. I don't know. Okay. So here, you see these parts here? That are, they're a bit like that. You want to go and flush them over like that. Just a bit of... Maybe a bit of, maybe, nah, there you go, see? So like that, okay? Kind of like, you see these solid marks here? You want to like clear them, like that. Okay. So yeah, it kind of blends with the clouds over here, like that. Okay, so just a random, kind of like a random shape, you know, give it some shading here. I just use your, your brush here, like that. Okay? Don't okay. spoil the painting, now yeah. it looks... Yeah, correct, so go below the, the thing, yes, that's right. Yeah, scrub it in. So we have different like shades of purple with the clouds. Okay. Oh, I need more paint. Yep. Why, why Stretch it out. Water? Stretch it out water? a bit. That looks looking good, bro. The paint is left side. Yes, that's right. Yep. Perfect. And like scrub that in, give it a bit of like different colors and whatnot. Later on, we will do a one part called a highlight part. So the highlight part is going to be really fun. You're really going to enjoy that part. Okay. okay. Yep. Scrub right below it. So we want to show the different colors that are in the clouds. So some clouds are bright. Some clouds are dark. Right? That's what we want to do. If it gets a bit too rough, right? We need a bit of uh, water. Yeah. Just below that. Mm-hmm. Yep. Very good. Excellent. Just below that surface. That's right. Correct. 
Yep, scrub it down and then this one, yep. Let's not go too down, just stay on that below part, okay. Very good, above part, yeah. And then just a bit more in the back there, kind of like taper it down. It's still quite rough. Yep, just tap the edge, yes, correct, okay. Go below, you see, going too much on top, so if you go too much on top, then the colors will be whatever. Don't, don't, don't scrub it, okay. Uh, very good, okay. Now let's go back to the red cloud, yeah. Now do the red cloud, do from here this section, just come in. With your imagination, see where the cloud is, yes, tap, 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 very good. Excellent. Kind of like get a shape for it. Okay. <laughs> Try it. Yeah. But it's dry. It's okay. It's just a bit of blend. It's dry. I cannot blend. Good. Like, we want to make it as natural as possible. Very good, excellent. Yeah, see? Perfect. I think you've done a really good job here. You said it took a, a dry breath. No, it's okay, it's okay. Nice. Alright. So Hamza is now drawing the line of the road. And this is what it looks like. So now we are painting the road. Okay. It's not road. Well, yeah. Remember to keep within the lines. Okay. Do it very carefully and very slowly. Right. Because we need it nice and slow. Okay. We need more paint, buddy. Because this is not enough. Yep. Yeah, that, that kind of blue, that's right. right. Make sure you get your paint on the palette itself, okay? Very good. Going a bit above outside the line, huh? don't do that. Because I need it to look a bit straight. Okay. okay I think we need a little bit more blue here. Let's get it. That is called precision, bro. That is precise. Right, right, exactly, exactly right. Mm -hmm. I'm mm -hmm. trying to transfer the paint here. Okay, if it doesn't go, then I'll, I'll go, go to this section now and push it down sideways. Yep, because you want that, the blue to be like really like solid blue, like bright. Because it's going to be the center part of the painting. Right, oh. A lot of paint. Okay, let's Alright, alright, so you got a road in place it's, it's So now we're going to do the forest part uh, Hamza is going to do the colouring for the forest Okay, let's go. Hey. Yep. Yep. Tap it all in. Tap it all in. Tap it tap tap. Tap it all. In. No, no, please don't do like that. <laughs> Look what you did to my brush. Jeez. Okay. It should be that. Okay. I'm making it dark for you. What's the... Very smart. Right, Robert. Okay, get some more brush. Yep. Green it up. You must go like this on the paint. Oh, okay. Okay. Tap it, tap. So you get this type of color. We want this type of color. Okay. Be careful of the road, okay? I don't want to get it into the rope. Alright. Right ho. Superb. Yeah, tap it up. That looks great, man. Now this is better. Now you got white, they got a white spot there. Alright. So I guess we need more green on the other side. Wow, painting is looking great, man. Look at the amount of colours. We've got a blue road. And we've got this green forest thingy going on and Hamza is tapping away. It's Mr. Tapper. Right, Mr. J. W. Tapper. Okay, now, can you tap the painting? Thanks. Mr. J. W. Tapper. Okay, don't go there. 
I want you to go on the white area on the right hand side. The right hand side. Yeah. Yes. That is what I'm talking about. Great, great, fantastic, excellent. Yeah, tap the white areas. I've already gone over that. Just tap the white areas. Can you please just wait? Okay. Last time, right? This is like this is like a masterpiece of huh? the colors and everything. It's gorgeous. Right, right. Tap, tap, tap. Tappity tap. Mr. Tapper. Your name is Mr. Tappy Tap Tap. So here we are going to apply the darker shades. Oh, don't make your brush horizontal, right? Always keep it like this, vertical. So it kind of looks like plants, right? You need some more paint. Get it, we need a bit, make it a bit darker. Right. Yep, perfect. That's it. That's what we want. Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh, so in the middle of this, Hamza is trying to do the stars now. No, I got paint. It's okay, don't worry. No way, artists get their hands dirty all the time. They can wash it. Yeah, yeah, that's right. And now we need to just do gently, gently. Don't use force, okay? Don't remember the harder you do it, the stars won't come out so nicely. You have to be very gentle and slow, like like a snail. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Okay. Be careful of your hand. Don't squish the other stars, okay? Yeah. Perfect. See, just gentle, small stars. Perfect. Randomly everywhere. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You're getting it right, sir. Oh, that's too much. Just gentle dots. Yep, perfect. Um, I need the brush to be like Never mind, you gotta twirl you gotta twirl it. So when your brush when your brush when your brush becomes a bit weird like that, you gotta just touch it a bit like that, see? Touch it, drag it out like wiggle it and then rotate it. See? So now you got a sharp point, right? That's what you want. So nice tap it. Nice. Yes. Woo! Starry, starry night. That's a big fat one. Okay, try this section here a bit. Slowly, slowly. Remember, calmly do it. Yes. Here. Dude, this looks really gorgeous. I think there's enough stars. Hmm? What do you think? Enough? Come, let me see the thing. Are you coming back home and doing it? Oh, if you want. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because that would be doing my action. Okay. okay, so we have finished the uh, green color bushes and forest. Uh, and now, the last step is Siren Head. Okay, so what's going on today is that we are adding the final touches to our Siren Head painting. And Hamza is working there with a liner brush. A very, very thin brush this is. And you need to know. So if anyone using a liner brush, what I suggest is this one needs to be nice and like like moist like that see yes yeah, so you have to flow with the the thing and you should get you should get a let me see if i can focus here okay you should, i can't focus i don't know what it is anyway okay there you go nice and smooth line there you go now you can do it okay yeah. so how you use the liner brush can i teach you 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 do so, like point so so the way the liner brush works, right, is that you need you need to thin it down. Okay, so it's like a like like this. See, just gently move it like that. So I give you an example how to use a liner brush. Liner brush, you get, you cannot you cannot do from the top like that. It won't work. Okay, what you need to do is you need to get it. Drag it. Yeah. So something like this. Let me show you on the. This is too much paint on the liner brush. So you make sure you get it off and then just do it like that. Like that. This is how you do a liner brush. Mm -hmm. So if you're doing a painting like that, right, just gently touch it. Follow Touch the it. lines and, and there you go. That's it. That's how you do it. Okay. Do more. Anything? Is there any more lines? I think that should be it, right? Mm hmm Yep. Yeah. Makes sense. Maybe just draw one more here. Perfect. Yeah. Good. Okay, and we just connect this line over here. I think there's a disconnected line here. And then 
thing with the liner brush is that it, it doesn't hold too much paint. Yeah, okay. Right, next. Oh, I like it. Yep. Nice. So he's adding the shadows to the mouth. Okay, that's good. Now remember to add some shadows so we can on the side of the body as well. Yep. Oh, you're doing the thing perfect. Beautiful. This is amazing. I like it a lot. Beautiful. Wow, already dry so far. Yeah, now you need to do the skeleton, the, the hands. The, the, uh, the, this one. A little bit. Just touch a bit here and there. Don't don't cover the whole thing. Yeah, just touch. Give it an idea of... You need to get an idea of some shading. Yeah, perfect. Not too much. Huh? Just just gently. Okay, enough, enough. Okay, enough. Yeah, just touch a bit. Okay, very good. Excellent. Alright, superb. Let me get you some more white paint. Painty. Okay. There's enough paint for the side. Yeah, now you need to do the sides. Okay, good. Okay. Nice. You know, you just need to get like an impression of it. Like, you know, to get like perfect. Yeah. Then draw the bones later on. Coming in the body. Now, okay, doing the legs first. Okay, do the legs first. Excellent. So this is called adding highlights. Okay, so there, there, there are dark parts to the shadow. I mean, there, there are dark parts to the painting, and there's also light parts. So when we have it, we have a bit more realistic. Uh Yeah, randomly just go and you can go in a bit. Yep, correct. Nice and random. You can do the you can do the inner tie here a bit. I'm mixing with a black, is it? Okay. Yeah, to yeah. get like a bit dark shape. Yeah. It's looking Quite nice actually. Siren head painting. Yeah, now don't forget the ribs. We need the ribs. You need to finish his body first. Don't do the legs first. Just finish the body a bit. So it looks like the lines are going. Yeah, correct. The white, perfect. Okay. Yep. They almost go in one direction when we random about that. Okay. And then it's the middle part. Yep. Don't don't make it too thick, huh? Yep. I just want the paint to spread. Hmm. Because I, I want it to be like a bit dark. For the ribs, want it to be like a bit dark. Oh, you added a bit of black there. You got a nice shadow effect. That's good. I like your idea. It's good, good idea you had right there. Okay, good. Now we just need to like, we to flick it. Yep, flick it up. Good. Yeah, I'm just gonna like blend it a bit. I don't do the road piece. Okay. Now, right, we need to do the hands. Let's get the hands done. Yep. Too much. Spread it a bit. Yep. Perfect. Okay. Correct. Yes, sir. All right. We can do the highlight the edge of the hands. Don't go outside the line, but inside. Yep. Leave the other side black, huh? Don't do the whole hand white. Leave the other side black a bit. There's too much white. You went in too much. You just go the outside. Yeah. I'm flicking it. Yeah. That's don't go why too it's deep. like too much. Don't go too deep. Then why do you see it going mm, deep? This is the thing over here. Hey Google! 
Oh, Rika? Is she doing something? Okay. Oh, beautiful. That is nice. Yeah, nice. Looks like this. All right. All right. Okay. No. So, let's call it a day. That's a good... Okay. Oh, wow. Look at that. Hamza, how do you feel about this painting? What do you do? You, what, do you like it? Mm -hmm. So, can you tell me what is this painting about?